It was a breakthrough nearly 20 years in the making, and it could help bring an end to Alzheimer's. A fight for a cure happening right here in Southeast Texas. ABC 13's Nick Natario talked to UTMB researcher about how this could be a game changer. The FDA has approved two Alzheimer's medications, but they're not convenient, time consuming, and they don't reverse symptoms. UTMB, though, released a new study using something different with a puff. Medication goes to the brain that does reverse Alzheimer's symptoms. The fight against Alzheimer's is intensifying. The Alzheimer's Association says the crippling neurological disease impacts 7 million Americans. Now, a new study could change everything. We think it is the right drug and the right delivery. Um, method. So we're very excited. At UTMB in Galveston, a team of researchers developed a drug that attacks bad stuff in the brain that causes Alzheimer's. It hasn't been approved by the FDA. Two other medications have, but they're different. The approved drugs slow the onset of symptoms that can only be used early on. The nasal spray, how does it work differently? It doesn't just delay. You're saying it, 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 it improves? It reverses. Reverses, it. reverses. At least so far, it reverses it. The nasal spray was used on mice. Researchers hope to try it on humans within the next five years. It's much more streamlined right now. So I would, I would say even maybe shorter, hopefully. A breakthrough that's been worked on for nearly 20 years at UTMB. Now there's hope a cure could only be a decade away. I think we're going to have more than one drug which will cure almost all people who get Alzheimer's and dementia. I'm pretty confident. Fight against Alzheimer's that's intensifying right here in Southeast Texas. Nick Notario, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.